I gotta tell you the truth. I was disappointed. I was disappointed with the quality of the of this camera via the USB. So this is an HDMI video capture. Yeah. So this is take two of the webcam series via the Sony A5100 and of course I've uh, bought this little thingy right here which is an HDMI video capture so um, this is it because in the last video I was really disappointed with how uh, the autofocus went and how the lagging I mean it had a huge lag I mean via the USB but I mentioned in the video and I also mentioned in the comment section that that was a comparison between the Sony A5100 via the USB cable and not via a video HDMI capture as you can see here and I mean the difference is really amazing I would say just look how fast it Autofocus, it also it's set up on auto. It already detected my face, as you can see here. It moves so it can focus my face. But is it better than a webcam? I don't know. So before I put the camera here, as you can see over here in this video, I had it way up there near the webcam and I gotta tell I gotta tell you to be honest at first I was really disappointed with off autofocus and so on but now of course this is a lower angle and this is the upper angle from the webcam let me just move this out of the way and now now you tell me these are both in the same place right let me see this is the webcam over here and I'll put my finger on it and this is the Sony right here even with my finger in the in the front I mean I, I prefer the image quality on the Sony I mean it's much more light much more brighter and on the webcam it kind of tends of looking darker I don't know why because I got my ring light on um, let me just uh, demonstrate sorry about that chair noise it drives me crazy but I'll get a new chair soon. So let me just uh, stop the ring light. And I've, I've just stopped the ring light, which is behind the webcam. And you can clearly see this is a darker area. I mean, a darker scene, let's say not area because it's the same face. The webcam, it's struggling to focus on me. And if we move it again and start, this is with uh, worm and I think this is the best scenario because you can see in the webcam I look really um, red, reddish I would say while in the Sony I look more realistic I would say I, I gotta enjoy, I, I gotta tell you I enjoy more the Sony would you buy it? I don't know this is the $50 version on the right side of the screen as you are seeing right now and the Sony is the 500 version only the camera you need a video capture you also need cable you also need the battery that keeps delivering power to your camera but the advantage is you take the camera away I like I would just pick it up like this and you go and make some pictures outside you make a new video you do whatever you want you are free to move with it while the webcam hmm, you're kind of stuck it's right there you cannot take it and move, go outside you cannot make videos you cannot do pictures or any other thing i know for this there is the phone in your pocket it depends on the phone what kind of phone do you have so yeah as you can see here i'm uh, trying to move the camera in a different angle just to see if it will focus but i gotta i gotta tell you it's clearly 1080p while this one just lost by a lot i mean the quality 
they just lost me. You can clearly see on the camera the hair on my beard. Each individual hair, while on the webcam just lost it. Yeah. So, let's draw a conclusion. Because I'm gonna leave you to see some footage with the camera over there. So it also depends where you put your camera, how much light is behind it, how the scene is prepared, because you gotta think of all these things if you wanna start this. I mean, this can be, I don't know, gaming, vlogging, whatever you're doing. This is the better option from my point of view. But it depends on your budget. And this was it uh, with this. I think I can uh, conclude this series and also the whole uh, dilemma that I had between webcam and uh, camera and phone. I, I didn't want to start the whole phone because uh, uh, first you're going to destroy your battery because you're going to be charging it every night and so on. And do you want to destroy your phone also? And what happens if you get a call, you have to unplug it, you have to get it out, you have to... So for me, if I have to choose between this one and this one, clearly this is the better option. Thanks for watching. And uh, don't forget to give a like on the video. If you enjoyed this type of contest, if, if this type of content, damn it, it's really late here. It's almost uh, 12 o'clock midnight and I'm recording right now because my daughter just fell asleep and I got some silence in the house. So now I can record so I can enjoy this camera and also I can see the true value and God, I mean, we gotta see, look, look at the level of details. I know, I gotta shave. That's it. Thanks for watching. Bye.